Yeah. Go put some clothes on. I won't be a minute. Try to get it through your head, Jeanette. I only came in to tell you goodbye. Goodbye? Pierre! It's all over. You had your choice? Either me or the so-called profession you're working at. You're still working, so that means I'm through. Oh, please don't treat me like this. You know your ship is about to sail. It's better for us. It's easier if I go away. Easier to what? To suffer even more than we both have already? You know we belong to each other, Pierre. Oh, please, Jeanette. That's in the snow. No. Pierre! Better move on. There's a mob of people out there. They want you to do another number. I won't do another number. I'm fed up with this job. eyes of Professor Moray, there isn't a bit of hope for me, mutilated, disfigured, forever. You might as well be prepared for the worst, but it won't make any difference to someone who really loves you. I don't want to be pitied by anyone, especially by him. Don't leave me alone. At least drink a cup of tea. Leave me alone! <laughs> She has no family here, not even friends close enough to worry about her. The newspapers made that clear. Go to her. Does anyone know you in that clinic? No one. And no one must know that Jeanette Morino is coming here. No one will know. I have complete faith in you as always. And I know that I shall succeed. You're going to need me. I'll be here, Albert. 